The US Open has been the most unpredictable tournament in terms of determining the winner. Federer was able to win five in a row. Why was Federer able to achieve such dominance at this tournament? I, I mean, I wouldn't overcomplicate this question. Why was Federer able to kind of dominate the US Open at that time? It's because he he was quite dominant at the other three slams as well. If you're going to take the, the period between 2004 and 2008, I think the US Open has been the major of opportunity for folks outside of the big four for the last 10 years because of its spot on the calendar. There's just been more wear and tear, more injuries, more fatigue, you know, stuff that has just kind of leveled the playing field. But I will say on the topic of kind of taking care of your body and withstanding the wear and tear of the tour, few, few, if any, were better than Federer mentally and physically. Roger, for most of his 20s, was just no injuries, always feeling great, always feeling happy. It was just kind of smooth sailing at the time.